Hi everyone, I'm Irina, an English teacher from Moldova. Welcome to this channel. You can't learn a language without learning about its culture, traditions and holidays. So any student of English who studies this language would like to know about St. Valentine's Day, a holiday of love which is spread all over United States, United Kingdom and some other English-speaking countries. Are you ready for a dose of teaching tips? Besides delivering a lesson about St. Valentine's Day with its cultural subtext, it's a great way to practice all four skills – speaking, reading, listening and writing. Just be creative and let your imagination fly. You can start by breaking the daily routine You could also decorate your classroom. The poster you see in my background you can find in the description to this video. You can use it to practice some words, vocabulary. Use some music, find a love song, but choose it carefully. Come up with some listening activities, sing, have fun, play games, read some poetry. I love poetry. Compose your own poems. It's not that difficult as it seems. For those students who think they don't have any artistic skills, you can provide a template that doesn't require any rhyme and anyone can feel themselves in the shoes of a poet. Excellent storybook for children, Somebody Loves You, Mr. Hatch. You can find it on Storyline online. Also there you can find some teacher's notes and a worksheet for your students. And although it is a story for children, I did it with my adults, pre-intermediate level, and they all enjoyed it because it was illustrated, simple, it was easy for them to listen and understand the words and then talk about the plot of the story. Mr. Hatch was tall and thin, and he did not smile. Every morning at 6.30 sharp, he would leave his brick house and walk eight blocks to the shoelace factory where he worked.